The wingspan stent system is designed to access tortuous neurovascular anatomy. Use a 0.014 inch exchange length guide wire to cross the stenosed lesion. A microcatheter can be used to obtain access if desired. Advance the gateway PTA balloon catheter over the exchange length guide wire until it reaches the stenosis. Cross the lesion with the balloon catheter and position the catheter relative to the lesion to be dilated. Marker bands on the balloon will help guide positioning. Slowly inflate the gateway PTA balloon catheter to its nominal size to gently open the lesion. The balloon should be undersized to no more than 80% of the vessel diameter. Once the lesion has been dilated, deflate the gateway PTA balloon catheter and remove the balloon catheter while maintaining guide wire position across the lesion. Advance the wingspan stent system over the exchange length guide wire. Continue to advance the delivery system over the guide wire until the stent is slightly distal to the target lesion. Observe the proximal and distal marker bands indicating stent position. Advance the inner body of the delivery system until the proximal marker band bumper is just proximal to the stent. This prepares the stent for deployment. Slightly withdraw the delivery system until the stent is directly aligned with the lesion. The stent should extend approximately 3 millimeters over each side of the lesion. The stent is now ready to deploy. To deploy the stent, the inner body should be held stationary with one hand while the other hand withdraws the outer body. This results in an unsheathing of the stent. Once the stent is fully deployed, the delivery system is removed.